Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. My name is Evidence and in today's video I'm going to show you how to upload your local CSV file and make it available online. So when you're doing data analysis you can use your online URL that contains your data instead of pulling the data from your local computer. So this is like a data set, a CSV file that's available in my local computer. If I want this um, CSV file to be available online, there are a couple of ways to do it, but the easiest way to do it is to use GitHub. So log into your GitHub account. As you can see, I'm logged into mine. And let's just um, go under this repository. And from here, you can click on upload files. And then you choose the file, the CSV file that you want to upload. In this case, I want to upload this file. And once that's done, and let's give it a name. And you come into the changes. And as you can see, under this repository called testing, this is the CSV file that we just uploaded. If you click on it, you see a snapshot of the CSV file itself. Now, you, for you to get the URL that you will use in your data analysis, you click on raw. And this is what the data set is going to look like. And you copy this URL. Then you go back to Visual Studio Code or Jupyter Notebook or whatever you're working with and load the data. So let's go ahead and create a new Python notebook. So I'll show you, show you that the URL works. So first thing first, let's import pandas, which is what we use to read CSV files. And we do pd.readcsv, which is pandas.readcsv. And in this case, I'll type in the URL that I just copied. As you can see, this is the URL that I copied from online. Let's run this. And then let's do expectancy.head. As you can see, the data itself is loaded. So this data in our online URL has been loaded on our local computer. So whenever you are working on your local computer, you can just use the URL instead of getting the data from your local machine. And that is how you would take a local CSV file and make it available online. If you don't have GitHub, there is another way to do it. The second way you could potentially do it is to go to this website, sharecsv.com. And just so you know, this is not a secure website, but it will work. But it works a little bit differently than GitHub. So the way this website works is you upload your file And after the file is uploaded, you see a snapshot of what the file looks like. And then you can just grab this URL. And let's say if you paste this URL in a new window, you get the file. So you can share this URL with people if you want. And then you can click on download. Once you click on download, sometimes it actually works and download your CSV file. And sometimes it doesn't. But if you are a data scientist, you should have GitHub anyways. And GitHub, I have found, is the easiest and fastest way to upload your local CSV files online and have it available online and be able to use it. If you use um, something like, if you use a website like this one, you actually cannot read from this CSV. I've tried before and it doesn't work. So... There's that. Anyway, I hope you liked this video and I hope you found it helpful. 
please give this video a big thumbs up and subscribe and that will make me really happy. <laughs> Thank you all for watching and I will talk to you guys again next time. Bye!